Welcome to day 32 of lockdown. And once again, I have some introspective questions for you. Um, one of the things in our life that can cause a lot of um, unhappiness is having expectations that aren't uh, real, aren't, aren't um, doable, aren't in line with our capabilities. And that can lead to a huge sense of failure. So the first question I have for you today, which is number 92 on the set of 100 questions I have for you, is what do I expect from my friendships? Because if it is in line with reality, then I'm likely to feel very fulfilled and happy in my friendships. But if I'm not, what am I expecting that might be impossible for others to achieve? So I want you to have a look at what my expectations are of friendships. So do you just want a good time? Do you want lots of laughs? Do you want some real connection? Do you want to do things together? Um, do you want to be intellectual with each other? Uh, do you just want them to care and love, uh, love you for who you are? How much support do you expect? All of those questions will um, play a role in helping you define the answer to number one. Question number two is a lovely one. What am I doing when I'm at my happiest? Where am I? I probably will be laughing and enjoying. Um, and then the last question is to think of a challenging situation that you are facing in your life at this moment. It may well be the challenging situation of being in lockdown. Um, it may be the challenging situation of maybe having lost your job um, as a result of the COVID-19 uh, or you might have huge financial stresses, or it might be none of those things. It might be something very different and unrelated to COVID. But I want you to think of a challenging situation. And then I want you to find what the silver lining is in this challenge. So even though it is a huge challenge and something that you're battling with, can you find a silver lining? And with that thought, I leave you. And uh, thank you as always for joining me and please join me tomorrow for the next set of three questions.